Hi guys, I'm Tim from ECU Testing and today I want to talk about one of the most common causes of non-start and intermittent engine cutting out issues on the Ford Focus built between the years of 2004 to 2011. In most cases, the root cause of these failures is the instrument cluster. Ford have designed the immobiliser PAT system to run through the cluster's internal operations. So when the cluster becomes faulty, the security system is unable to function properly, causing the engine to cut out. Now this fault may first present itself as an intermittent failure. You may also notice the gauges or warning lights flickering on and off. In our experience, this fault will progress over time and eventually result in a permanent failure, meaning the engine won't start at all. So, if you attempt to read fault codes from the instrument cluster, you may find U1900 CAN communication bus fault receive error intermittent. Or you may find U0155 lost communication with instrument cluster in the ECM. This instrument cluster will usually have electronic faults within the cluster itself and with no repair kits available from the manufacturer, the OEM's advice is to replace the instrument cluster, which is incredibly expensive and you will also have to pay for coding. Plus, the replacement will still have the original design flaw, meaning it's extremely likely that it could fail at some point down the line. To solve this, our research and development team have carefully crafted a market-leading rebuild solution for this failure of the instrument cluster. The internal circuits have been reverse engineered, analysed and reworked to fully eradicate the original manufacturer design flaw. All internal coding of the unit is retained, so there's no need for any programming. You can be rest assured that this rebuild solution also comes with our unlimited mileage lifetime warranty. That extra peace of mind. So, to summarise, if you are experiencing symptoms such as non-start or the vehicle intermittently cutting out and fault codes U1900 and U0155 present, then this is often an indication that your instrument cluster has failed. Sending your control module for a rebuild could not be simpler. Just fill out our online test form with details of your fault and select your preferred collection date. Ensure that the module is safely packaged to prevent any damage that could occur during transportation. Once we receive your unit, it is then scheduled to an engineer who will fully test your control module to confirm the faults. You will then be notified of the test results along with the full rebuild quotation. You can make payments instantly by credit or debit card or via PayPal. As soon as payment has been made, your engineer will be informed and your unit will be rebuilt. It will then be retested to ensure the full eradication of the fault. Your unit is then shipped back to you via next day tracked career service.